going onto the recruiting tab will show you a lot of posts about one certain thing. Look, I just went on it and already the first post reads it. Draco. Given the fast diversity in this game, with over 200 regular mission nodes, an entire void, derelict system and more, what is this Draco that it's so immensely popular amongst the community? It must be very exclusive to play and it must require only the best equipment in the world. You'd think so, but allow me to show you what this is all about. Now for this I'm gonna grab an unranked weapon which I just claimed. Then I'm gonna go to the navigation and select series. There we will find the interception mission, Draco. As you can see Draco is a very normal interception mission with very normal towers and very normal enemies. However it's famous for its affinity. Just being there for a run will allow your equipment to rank up immensely if you do it right. See that chap over there? He's ranking his ass. Or he's just very stupid and trying to rank his weapons. But that won't work like that, as all the kills he's making with his Ash's powers will only grant affinity to his Warframe. So how do you go about this mission? Well like any interception mission you will have to capture the towers, but in the meantime you will also have to kill a lot of enemies, which will grant you affinity to rank up your equipment. So use the basic rules of affinity here to increase your leveling. Killing with weapons spreads the affinity over all your gear, so the fewer weapons you take along with you, the faster you rank. Killing with your sentinel only levels your sentinel, as does killing with your warframe only levels your warframe. Now you shouldn't go in there with unranked gear only, even though you will have squad mates to help you up and grant you affinity. You will have to be able to survive on your own, or you'll only be a burden. But if you do it right, the rewards aren't so bad.